ground zone for the Galaxy S2. It's still in beta and not everything is working as perfectly as it should, but let's take a look at the future hybrid between Samsung's TouchWiz UI and Google's Refresh UI in the latest Android ice cream sandwich. First, we have the custom lock screen, which does not feature a camera option. Um, this feature is enabled from any point on the screen and unlike the, the, the previous feature is not restricted to one part in the lower portion of the screen. Scrolling between the TouchWiz home screens occurs smoothly and can be done either by dragging across the scroll buttons or by tilting the screen. Adding and removing home screens occurs by pinching the display And you can rearrange home screens on this menu easily. The notification drawer is typically TouchWiz. The only ICS feature that is present here is the ability to remove notifications by dragging them left to right. ICS multitasking is also accessed by holding down the home button. You can add or remove currently active tasks by dragging them left and right. Changing wallpapers is done by pressing on the on an empty space in the main screen and then changing the relevant and selecting the relevant option and changing the home screen. You can also add or remove widgets in the traditional ice cream sandwich and gingerbread fashion. The application menu is exactly the same as the old TouchWiz. Here, the contact screen is slightly different from the traditional TouchWiz interface in that it adds the ability to uh, access favorite contacts and is a feature that is identical to the new ice cream sandwich group. Smart dialing works in the exact same fashion as the classic release of TouchWiz. Messaging is identical as TouchWiz. And here we have the new Gmail redesign, which features the ability to slide between active messages. Settings feature the new ICS toggles as well as the data usage option. Face unlock while present in this build of TouchWiz is currently not supported. The gallery is identical to earlier builds. It features tilt navigation and is smooth. Web browsing features several new features, but is still smooth as ever. The first is the new incognito window which allows you to browse and surf without memorizing your visited sites or cookies. You can also request a desktop version of the site that you're looking at. Finally, you can save for offline reading.
This was the newest ice cream sandwich beta for the Galaxy S2 featuring Samsung's TouchWiz UI.